look at the commonality of the human nature of in, within all of us, we want to get excited, we want to get transported in music. And the covers are different. You know, we all dress differently, we speak differently, and uh, our thought process is different, but ultimately, those common emotions are the same. You know, happiness, sadness, excitement, and spiritual, you know, this thing, whatever, whatever we, we feel. And if you take that and connect it, it's all possible. There's never a no. And you have to keep your mind open it. And you have to open it in a way where you don't reject anything. You embrace everything. I learn from everyone. I mean, yesterday I was watching you guys doing different arrangements to my songs. I learned something from there. So learning should never stop. And it's a day-to-day -day process. Not only from music, from life and how people deal with things. When you're composing, what is your creative process? Is it melody that comes first or chords or is it random? You know, it's just in the spur of the moment? Now it's mostly iPhone. <laughs> 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 Going. And I'm always flying, so I just go near, near a place where nobody's there and start humming and people come, what, what is he doing? I lock myself and see what comes out, secretly. <laughs> and I do a lot of ideas. And for a, for a song, I don't just stick with one idea. I feel like, even though I feel good, I say, okay, let me try one more. And I listen to it three, four days later. And it's, if it still impresses me, if it still has something in it, then I send it to the director and say, what do you think? We have four bad ideas. <laughs> I started writing country songs when I was 14. It's been my dream to come to Berkeley, and I just started my first semester. And I walk around this college now, and I see these amazing musicians, and I'm like, why would someone listen to an Indian country singer-songwriter when they can listen to an American? So what was the one thing that kept you going to stand out? I think you should be proud of your identity, and you should be... Uh, um, so, so there's a wealth of things within you and you're looking for something else. So even if you write country songs, write about your own country. It could be the same the tune of a country kind of progression. But why don't you write about Delhi? Why don't you write about Calcutta? <laughs> why don't you write about things? So it becomes more original. You have it than you. And you don't have to write about what countries, which beautiful songs. I love country music too. Yeah. The lyrics and everything. So that's what I think. Most of us get confused. And we, uh, you know, when, even when I was growing up, I was playing Rush and Deep Purple. <laughs> we all came from the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> then I realized that it's the energy which we love. Yeah. But the content could be ours. Right. And uh, we do that. Okay. Thank you.